So Alisa can practice that. And we eat chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you enjoyed the previous video, the one that we just posted. We never have I ever. If you haven't watched it yet, I hope you're gonna go watch it. I'm gonna leave a link down here. And today we're gonna be around the clinic, I think pretty much the whole week. So we're gonna take you guys with us for this week around uh, our life in Sibiu. Let's see where this goes. Okay, so we started the day straight into one of our last subjects of this semester. It was prosthodontics. My dad was doing a looks at temp temporary for a patient, so that was perfect that we were able to see the process. You can see here that he was gui making the guidelines in the already pre-made putty material, and then he injected the looks at temp material, make sure that there's no bubbles in there, and then it was placed in the mouth of the patient, and at the end you have to polish now it. Now we're gonna polish a little looks at temp uh, temporary, so Alisa can practice that. Let's see. Okay, so now we are fixing the T-scan because we're going to do a T-scan for a patient. Alisa, how are you? A little tired, honestly. A little tired. But I really want to see. Yes, so we're gonna see now a T-scan, basically occlusal equilibration, occlusal equilibration, and we'll check in later. Sometimes we have a break and we eat chocolate. Hi. <laughs> okay. Then. Now. And now you can see that the occlusion was now balanced, the right and the left percentages were not even close and also the center of force was not even close to the median line, which it has to be, you can see here, that now it's close after a small adjustment. Now we're gonna take the extra oral pictures, actually Corina will. So there's Corina, we have the patient there and there's a few pictures that we have to take. So that was it for yesterday. Today we are starting directly with implantology. As you can see here, Zina just took blood from the patient and we are putting them in special carpals where we're gonna put it in the centrifugal machine because this is called PRGF, which basically it's plasma rich in growth factors. We are making a membrane from the plasma of the patient that we're gonna use for them and it's gonna be way better for the healing and everything is actually very good and enhanced. Now we're gonna have to leave it in this machine for like 15 to 20 minutes and after this we are gonna transfer it with some syringes in uh, some special containers which uh, she's preparing now but uh, I forgot to film that part of the video but you can also see though at the end here the actual membrane that we just made. Okay so Alisa will go into a surgery so we're gonna prep her now. Ready? Okay. Okay, we are done for today in the clinic. So we finished for the clinic today, so now we came to eat. All you can eat. Yes. Yum. What is this? I don't know. What is that? Cheesy? Mm. And after we ate, we came home, we napped, and now we're on a walk with Maya.
So we're out on a nice walk, bike ride with the sunset. Bike ride, show us your bike. <laughs> yes, let's go. We stopped for a break where we're so sweaty. I'm so sweaty. How was it though? It was nice. It was yeah, it's very nice. My my though, she was very tired. She said no more. No more hide. No more hide. <laughs> Wait, Maya. Your girlfriend. And now we are playing sequence. Second day done, third day in. Of course, we have to start with the chai latte. Another surgery. Today, third day in the clinic, starting with an implant. If you need implants, guys, call me up. <laughs> I'm approved by the end of So after you took that little break, as you can see there, we were like laughing for a second there. I helped Dr. Flavia with some patients. And if you want to see more of her, I have a video actually with her about Mojo. So now we have a little break. The implant is done. I also stayed in. It was very interesting. Did you like it? Yeah, the implant. This one was really fast. Very fast. And not as invasive. Yeah, minimal invasive. Minimal invasive. Yeah, that's true. It was basically, I think, like 50 minutes maybe without anesthesia. Very fast. And now I will have a class, my German class. And after it, we're gonna see. Chess? Bravo. Hi there. And after we were done with the cleaning for the day, we took my on a little bike run, which uh, became a little habit that we did every day. Okay, so today's Thursday. Is it Thursday? Yeah, and we're gonna cook some breakfast. Sweetener, some stevia. I'm not really much a coffee drinker, but a flat white from time to time. Leaving the house with uh, 1000 stuff when you have your camera, your laptop. Alisa is eating a peach. Let's look. This is proof to mom that I locked. Cheers. Bye, Maya. So going now to the course room and we're gonna prepare some models wow it's sunny outside so we can prep some teeth and practice what we did this semester because we are doing our summer practice here and of course we have to practice everything that we've done so we're gonna do that so we have here the course room and i'm gonna prepare some two spots for me and alisa it's like this 
and then we have teeth that we can just switch and everything so and it has cavities on it and you can just take this switch it up with a tooth in here and then you can prepare it so it's very very nice the ones that like my dad had printed so we don't have to use those to seven we basically just printed them in the 3d printer like this so wow such an influence one three we're gonna take it out just like that now we can take it put it in here and we just have to press it in two preparations on the two frontal teeth then we're gonna also prep an upper canine and on the lower arch we're gonna do a first lower molar and an incisor and we're gonna use opa, my dad's kit so this is the kit like this there's a lot of birds here i'm gonna send a picture and of course the top <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so for the rest of that day, we prepped teeth. Me and Alisa, we also both prepped the central incisor, as you can see also in this video. Uh, we did a veneer. We also did just a crown after we do the veneer. So it was very interesting. And that was very nice because we also had their a microscope. So we were able to work with the microscope and see how that is. It was a little bit more complicated than we thought, but it's also very nice and you see everything so good. And you see here that this was my prep for a veneer on the central incisor. Then here I was mid prepping the crown. It was midway. And then here is the final actually crown prep that I did. And of course we had to take a break and take a chai latte. Okay, so here we go. <laughs> so we're gonna go out. We Tour. are out. <laughs> we are out actually, yes. And we're going to a restaurant where I talked to Alisa so many times and she has never been all the years i've been coming here and, and finally she, finally i get food. exactly Whew. we're going up uh, 100 uh, thousand stairs it's okay because we're fit we're fit we're fit <laughs> girls <laughs> So today we just continued our work from yesterday, we basically continued to prep teeth. We just tried a new place in Sibiu called Supa, if you're ever here, very yummy. Of course, classic chai latte espresso shot. And she is trying now a rice with milk, it's like a Romanian thing, and it also has chocolate and coffee. Do you like it? Not really? It's weird. It's weird. Oh. Mm -hmm. Hi! Hi! And because Saturday was the last day for the girls here in Sibiu, we took them to a very nice brunch place, uh, Lumos it's called, if you ever come to Sibiu, it is very nice to go. So, we are eating brunch, guys. <laughs> we are say it again. No, <laughs> no banana. No banana. No banana. No banana. <laughs> Thank you very much guys for watching this vlog, I hope that you enjoyed it and if you did don't forget to subscribe and like this video. I'll see you next Sunday.